hello guys welcome to chat jamaican guys you know that i am your lady tanya and i'm so happy that you're tuning at this moment and i am here in montego bay jamaica with mr lloyd ashley and guys we're definitely so proud to be giving you the updates as to what is it that we're actually doing this far all right so it's indeed a, a great moment for mr ashley right now hi east side comedy vlogs big up yourself and thank you for being here and thank you for supporting at all times so guys i am in montego bay jamaica it has been a long long day traveled from saint elizabeth jamaica guys remember to like the video give the video a thumbs up and continue to support the channel in your best way possible right so eastside comedy a lot of love to you too and thank you for the support so guys i'm actually here in montego bay jamaica with mr ashley and guys you're just definitely proud and of everything that has been happening right now so mr ashley i'm going to put the video on you all right so guys i am in mr ashley hotel room all right so say hi mr ashley hi everybody <laughs> The whole world say. Mm, say a little louder. Well, hi to the whole world, everybody. <laughs> okay, so so guys, um, this is actually Mr. Ashley's room. That, that light can turn on. So I'm actually that light. It's a light. Yeah. Oh, so basically, Mr. Ashley, I want to tell them what it is that you're doing in Montego Bay. Well, um, I'm glad you're just still down here. So, basically, Mr. Ashley, I want to tell them what it is that they're doing. Well, to come and fit another artificial light, a new one, and proud to see it already, although it don't fit as yet. So yeah. you folks will see me very soon. Yeah. All right. So, so, guys, what Mr. Ashley is basically saying is that he's here to see um, the orthopedic is here to see the orthopedic doctor, the orthopedic technician, in order to construct his new legs that he needs to take him around. Aren't we proud of him at this moment? Okay, guys, so we have a great um technician that is going to assist mr ashley now this is a tour of mr ashley room he has a television in his room so you know he can watch what it is that he wants at a time and we're staying at a guest house guys um this is his bathroom he has a wonderful bathroom where he's going to stay into and support himself a great mirror dear at the mirror the bathroom that is there and you know hoping that he will be comfortable in this setting that we are leaving him into guys he's going to stay here for um a few days you know so i have to definitely go back head home to mind over this is his kitchen area and he has a counter right here that he's going to use guys this is his bed so, <laughs> so Mr. Ashley, you see a lovely bed that you have here that you're going to stay yeah. into. He has a fan. He has an air-conditioned unit where he can turn on his AC and the fan whenever he wants. And he has a dresser right there. So we're leaving him into comfort. Right, Mr. Ashley? Yeah. All right. So what is it that you want to say to everyone out there? Well, everybody take good care of himself. And respect to who look up to me and the one them who talk in their foolishness, tell them cut it out because time is against us, so be careful. And if you can't be good, take it easy. They are right. So you're proud now that um um have you 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 have seen the doctor today? Yeah. And what progress was made after seeing the doctor? What are your hopes? Well, hope to get through pretty early, that's what it said to me. 
that's all he said to you yeah. and then you're hopeful and know that he's going to deliver yeah yeah hmm? yeah <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so guys, I know that when I come back to Montego Bay, um, I'll definitely do an interview um, with guys. So when I come back to Montego Bay, I will definitely do an interview with the doctor to see his great work, to see what it is that he's going to do in order to help Mr. Ashley. He's a great doctor. I met with him. I've seen the progress that he has done today. What it is that he has done on the leg it was so unique but hopefully do while recording and um, what is the name of the company okay guys so definitely so it's rewalk prosthetics and the orthopedic supplies Rewalk prosthetics and orthopedic supplies and I'm letting you know that the, what he has done today is great so far and we're definitely proud of the progress, right? Yeah. So guys, I'm going to leave Mr. Ashley here for the entire week because he has to do the therapy. He has to, once the legs, once the legs are made, because the doctor is going to make the legs from scratch, right? So the legs will be made from scratch. And once the legs are made, um, Mr. Ashina will have to do therapy. And the therapy can last from one day up to two weeks, depending on how it is that he's progressing. But we do know that Mr. Ashi does well when it comes on to walking and stuff like that. So um, it is definitely going to make him a little bit better so you will what let me find out from mr ashley so so you will hold you think fast you will walk into the legs that will be provided well definitely i can't tell you yet. i can't tell you how fast i will move but i think i will move much faster no yes yeah. so what he's saying guys is that he will move a little bit faster no he will definitely do his best and he will walk and all of that. So Kanika, big up yourself, Joseph, you know, we should have people like you in St. Lucia. Blessings to St. Lucia over there. Um, Sandrine, Barbara, um, thank you for tuning in and being a part of this segment right now. So guys, I just given you a tour of Mr. Asher's room. Here in Montego Bay, Jamaica, we have been on the road from morning. From since 11. Uh, yes, from 11 a.m. we have been on the road. And then when we do find a place, we get lost. <laughs> we get lost. Um, but eventually we did find the place. And after finding the place, what else happened now? We got the opportunity to meet with the doctor Mr. Brown. Mr. Brown and Mr. Brown is you know very pleasant willing to complete the task that is given and then a full interview will be given with him to show the type of service that he offer and um, how it is that he go about producing these legs throughout his career a great doctor here in Jamaica and guys a great technician <laughs> he's a great technician here in jamaica itself and we all are going to be proud of him um due to the progress and the work that will be done on mr ashley's leg all right all right so guys just a recap i am here in montego bay jamaica that is in the parish of saint james you can look it up for everyone that is out there and what we're actually doing i have taken down mr ashley to see the orthopedic technician so we're here to see the technician in order to construct two legs for mr ashley and mr ashley is going to be proud of the legs and he is um liking the opportunity and everything that has been extended to him so we are definitely here um working to ensure that and um, we follow through with all of that. Yeah. So guys, let me know. Are you comfortable with where Mr. Ashley is staying? Are you <coughs> comfortable with his space and all of that? But let me find out from Mr. Ashley. 
or you like in your space that you're going to stay at for the past um, few days? Yeah, I like it. I like it. Mm -hmm. I like it. You like it? Yeah. So what Mr. Ashe is saying, guys, is that he likes the space and he's grateful for the opportunity that has been extended to him. All right? So, guys, I'm not going to stay long because I have a long drive to go. Right? And then because I have this long way to go, I'm going to say goodbye to Mr. Ashley. It was a pleasure staying throughout the day. I'm ensuring that all goes well. And now with this opportunity now that presents itself, I can go home and sleep peacefully. Right, Mr. Ashley? Yes. <laughs> what do you want to say to everyone out there? Well, everybody take good care of themselves. And who can pray, pray for me. Who can? We know some will talk them out full of rubbish, but tell me no man. Yeah. Leave them alone. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so um, Sandrina is saying that she would want that AC now. Nice going. Praise God. Eileen, big up yourself. Well done, poor man crawling on the ground. In the <laughs> 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 Thank you, Kanika. All right, so where is Mr. Ashley to keep his company? Mrs. Ashley. Guys, remember Mrs. Ashley is not well, so she has um, quite a few um, activities that need to be completed during the week. But hopefully, we're hoping that Mr. Ashley can, um, you know, fulfill his duties on his own, will be in constant communication and everything. Plus, the doctor is monitoring, the, the technician is monitoring and ensuring that he has company and that um, he's safe at this time. So guys, I have a long journey to go. So I'm actually going to say goodbye to everyone. So I'm going to put it back on Mr. Ashley and I'll give you all the opportunity to say goodbye. Hold on. All right, so Mr. Ashley, say goodbye to everyone for me. Everyone goodbye. Yes. So yes so guys we will see you again at a later date i will do the follow-up ensure all goes well and uh, mm, <clears throat> and all of that uh, organize the transportation organize lunch organize food all of that will be organized and then there about we'll go about um completing whatever activities that need to be done and then the doctor now will ensure that um he's given his the, the technician will ensure that he's given his therapy and that he's guided in the best way possible. So guys, please continue to support the channel. If you're new here, if it is your first time subscribe, if you're first time watching, please remember, please remember to subscribe to the channel and uh, all of that, guys. Okay. All right, so guys, we actually have the technician here with us, and he's just going to give an update as to what it is that um, will be done in turn because he's here with us. All right, so we have the technician here. His name is Mr. Brown, and he can give you an update as to what will be done. Yes, I'm Mr. Brown from Rewalk Orthopedic and Arthetic Supply. So today we have done the, major, the measurements for Mr. Hatchley to make two transtibial prosthesis and it's okay. He has strong legs. So by Friday, Mr. Hatchley will be walking. Yes. Okay. So um what what you have done today will give you the opportunity to start preparing the legs. Yes. So that the, it's a process to complete what it is you're about to do. Yes. Step 1, you make the skeleton of the leg. Then step 2, you dress it and you have him fitted and walking it. Okay, so when we come back, Mr. Ashe will be walking. Yeah, sure. All right, and we definitely, we are going to be proud. So thank you, sir. Sir Brown, he's the orthopedic 
technician and he's going to ensure that Mr. Asher received the legs that are well needed and he will be monitoring Mr. Asher while um, I am away for the few days. He will monitor, ensure that all goes well. He has organized the ride with the taxi to pick up and to drop off and also organize lunch and stuff like that. So it's great to have um, lovely um, orthopedic technicians out there who you know, are willing to help and will give Mr. Ashley the opportunity to walk again. All right, so guys, so Mr. Ashley, a lot of persons, they're saying that they're happy, proud of you and all of that. They're saying that you're looking good. <laughs> Mr. Ashley, tell them how you transform, no man. Tell them what happened when we come, come pick you up, how you look good. What, what did you do to your face? What? What happened? Well, I just going to get out from a Friday. The guy know to tell me that I'm going to be out. Couldn't come down like a ragamuffin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what Mr. Ashley did, Mr. Ashley went to the barber and then he, he went to the barber and then he, um, you know, shave up and all of that. You want to take off the hat? No, <laughs> But he doesn't want to take off the hat, guys. He doesn't want to. Yeah, everything will definitely work out great. Because I've seen the work of the technician today, and it was, you know, amazing to know that we have persons out there that are providing legs for people in Jamaica itself. So, guys... It is truly a blessing and all of that. Gloria is saying, hello, Mr. Brown. I pray everything will be okay. That's good. I'm happy for Mr. Ashley. So a lot of persons are happy for you. But guys, guess what? I, guys, remember to like the live, <coughs> like the video. Remember to like the video, guys. Like the video. Please like the video. Please like the video. Yeah, he looks definitely great. And Mr. Ashley is proud. And he's, I'm tell you, Mr. Ashley is proud that he's getting this opportunity. And you know, he has given me so many jokes. Mr. Ashley, I want to share the joke with the, yeah. um, with the policemen. No? no? <laughs> <laughs> Woo! So guys, I'm just here giving Mr. Ashley some joke. All right, so. Um, Let me hear that, right? Yes, definitely great. All right, so I'm going to say bye now because I have a long journey to go. I'm going all the way to Manchester, passing through St. Elizabeth. So go through St. James, then St. Elizabeth, then Manchester. It's a long journey, so um, I'm definitely going to go. So Mr. Ashley, they're actually saying you look great. Whoa. He looks great. He's all, all dressed up and everything, you know. Them nice, decent pants, nice, decent shirt and ready to go ready to get his legs so guys you will get an update soon hopefully by friday saturday to see the outcome of everything and then we will know if he will walk you will see him walking all right so what i'm going to do now guys i'm going to end the live so in the meantime i want you to continue to support the channel please remember to subscribe to the channel and share all of everything um and i'm proud of the progress and guys i just want to extend i just want to extend the continual love to you that you have been um given to the channel itself and myself and you know we are proud of the progress we're a team we're a family we're a community and we're indeed grateful that you are here with us, you know, um, giving each person that has touched this grace, this stage, the opportunity to something that they have not um, been given before. All right, so it is me here, your lady Tanya, and all I'm going to say to you, thank you for watching Chat Jamaican, guys. Little more, I have a long way to go. All right, bye-bye.